Hey, what's up everybody? It's your girl, Philly Girl 31, and welcome back to another video. Hi guys, I hope everybody's having a great week so far. Your girl is feeling a whole lot better than she has been the past few days, okay? Maybe even a couple of weeks, because your girl has been going through. <laughs> but thanks to all my well wishes, all my prayers from all my family here on the tube. I thank every last one of you so, so, so very much. Before we jump into this Halloween haul, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Yo, we get into that go, okay? We almost at 19, what? 1900 subscribers here on YouTube. I love it, I love it. My goal, for real, for real though, is to hit that 2K before my birthday, okay? My birthday's in August, so. Yes, and I'm a Virgo, so that means it's later. <laughs> later in the, in the month of August. All right, guys. So, this year, let's just do a little chat, okay? This year, your girl was like, hold on. When they did the little online members access on last Friday, I couldn't believe my eyes, honey, because I was like, ain't no way these prices is pricing like that. They were going, they were going, I felt like I was shopping at Pottery Barn and stuff like that. Coles, I mean, I was, I was out there like, Mm, what's really going on? So, all the little things I had on my list, I had to adjust the list, okay? So, let's start with, I have to break this up because I did get quite a few things. It's not a whole bunch of stuff that I thought I initially I was going to get, but I am going to break this up into a few parts. So, bear with your girl. We're, gonna, we're not going to make every video long and drawn out. We're just going to do cute and quick, okay? Because <laughs> we got a lot of stuff to go through. Up first, I did get my hands on the Fine Fragrance Mist Holder. So here she is in all her glory. Now, it comes off a little different type of purple. This is more like a fuchsia or, or whatever you want to call it. She has a nice little ring on her finger. She got her nails painted, y'all. Look at that. She got her nails did, y'all. Okay. So, the Fine Fragrance Mist will sit right here. It's like a little glass or whatever, but you can't really see through the glass. It's like a reflection. This retails for $24.95. And I remember last year when I brought the one that they had that was sitting up like this. <laughs> I was like, okay. Why don't they paint the nails? And... Thankfully, they painted them black because she got to have her pedicure done, her manicure done, okay? Don't play with her. Don't come for her. You can do it right, y'all, okay? So, appreciate Bath & Body Works for putting that color on those nails because this all white wasn't fitting for me. Now, let's jump into the candle holders. I'm really debating if I want to get the luminary, the house luminary. I started collecting the luminaries last year. And now I'm stopped this year because I'm like, 275 is a lot of money, y'all, for a freaking house. Like, really? I don't understand why they want to charge a sister so much money for that thing. It's beautiful, don't get me wrong, you know? I've seen it in person. It's beautiful. The details and everything are nice, but your girl is like, I don't know. I don't know. I got I to gotta, I gotta marinate on it. It's, I still haven't brought myself to get it. You know, I'm trying to have a coupon so I can get something off of it first. You know, a little something, a little 20% of do, 15% of do, you know. But they don't even want to give your girl that. So I'm like, mm, I don't know. It's still a lot of money. I did get the pumpkin in the black. This right here is so cute i mean you can see it's like crystals in here and in the inside purple crystals this retails for 49.95 and this is what it looks like lit up <laughs> yes this is so so pretty you can see inside of it y'all look look at the crystals yes so it's black all the way around uh, got a little stuff on it but um guys i need you to do me a favor so i would have did this video yesterday but i had to go back to the store this morning to exchange this for the one i brought yesterday i noticed when i got it home that it was two cracks 
in it so it was like one on the side and then it was one by the button and i'm like oh yeah i don't think so for 50 dollars, i need perfection okay so i um called the store made sure they had more in stock and i went back this morning we exchanged it and it was a lot of them not just the one that i had but it was a few of them that still had that same problem so we finally got through to one that didn't have any issues and i was able to exchange it so big ups and thank you for that because i will be doing a return real quick okay so if you're getting the pumpkin the black pumpkin make sure you check it for imperfections your girl went on ahead and got the, when i tell you look at this y'all look it's so beautiful like how they putting the buttons on the side you ain't got to flip this mug over to turn it on but i like it just as it is i don't like it um when it's turned on i like it as a statement piece turned off but i'll show y'all what it looks like on so there's the skeleton the skull mr skull you can see him right there he reminds me of like a moon man instead of like a skeleton on y'all i don't know he's giving air era um aerospace it's not giving me halloween but that's just me though <laughs> Your girl, your girl, your girl had was I was going back and forth with this next one. But when I finally seen it in person and then I seen it turned on, I was like, throw it in the bag, give it to me. I don't know the proper names for these. I'm just telling you what it looks like to me. It's the evil eye on top of the um the Oculus type of legs. Beautiful. Look at the look at the detailing in that. I mean, the colors, they did their thing. And let's turn it on. The eye definitely rotates all the way around. You don't hear any clicking sounds when you turn it on. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful design. I'm here for it. I'm here for it, y'all. Uh, and this retails for, how much is this one? This one is $69.95. And I don't know if I set the price on this one. This one is $49.95, which I was surprised that they gave it a $50 price tag. Cause it's pretty, I like it. Like I said, I'm not, I might not even turn it on, but I love the way it looks when it's off. And my last candle holder for this haul, <laughs> your girl had to go on and get the hearse y'all because I had the, car the carriage last year and I was like, your girl needs the hearse this year. And it looks like this. You can see, you got Mr. Scully over there driving. He driving Miss Daisy. So you can see Mr. Scully on this side and Mr. Scully on the other side. This joker is heavy y'all. So I apologize if I can't get it completely in view because my back is backing right now. On the back part of it, you have a Scully cat and one of their skelly kids riding in the back. You got a spare tire with the cobwebs and you got the little gems for the lights. And then let's roll to the other side so we can see Mrs. Skelly. <laughs> you see Miss Skelly on this side, y'all. There she is. This joke heavy, y'all, it's heavy. I'm almost finished. And then the front of the hearse, you can see them both and they got like the lights and then they got, is that a, okay, you got the bat sitting on the front as the bumper. So let's turn it on. And it is, the button is on the back. We appreciate that as well. And that's what it looks like. The lights are on in the front and they on. They pop in, they drop in, they dropping away. You got the lights up here, they light up. I wish it kind of went all the way around the hearse but they just did the sides for the lights and i wish the back lights would light up too you know what i'm saying for a hundred dollars y'all could have gave me a little bit more light but i guess they want to spare our pockets so we don't have to pay a lot in uh <laughs> in in um batteries so that retailed for 99.95 i'm glad i got my hands on it 
I wanted it. I knew that was one of my things that I wanted to get on my list because I got the carriage last year and I wanted that to match. So, I'm sorry guys, I'm just changing positions. Like I said, my back is hurting, but um, it's all good though. We're gonna get comfortable in a moment. <laughs> guys, riddle me this. Friday, Bath & Body Works did their um, release so us, for us to shop online, right? Members, okay. Remember the gazebo with the female cauldron standing at the stairwell? They did um, pretty good selling it, I guess, because now it's no longer available on the website. You can't even see it on the website today. It's just like completely gone. It disappeared. Now, I don't know if they're gonna re-release it or maybe something was wrong with it. You know how they do, they will pull stuff and don't even tell you why they pulled it. It's just gone, you know what I mean? So I don't know if it was something wrong. You know, they're perfectionists. They wanted it perfect and it probably didn't come out the way they wanted it for whatever reason. I don't know, but I wish I should have go ahead and, and got it that day. But I'm thinking if it is an imperfection, will they cancel that item in your order? and not even send it out to you. So let me know in the comments down below your thoughts on that one. And if you do know anything, I did um, speak to one of the managers in the store and she was like, they didn't even see it, the, um, the gazebo in their paperwork for releases. So they didn't even know it exists. And they were like, a lot of people are calling the store and asking when they're shopping in the store, where is the gazebo? So. Hopefully we'll get some word about it and um, it comes back out because I really would like to get my hands on that too. All right, guys. Thank you so much for rocking out with your girl. And stay tuned because I got more hauls to come, okay? So this is part one. I got part two. I might just do two parts depending on I got to relook over the stuff I got. If it seems like it's going to be a lot of time to talk about it and I'll break it into three parts. If not, it'll just be two parts. All right, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.